Howdy my friends, Scott Grove here, Dr. Groovy from GroovyMusicLessons.com with an axe that I love because I always love Washburn acoustic guitars. Anybody ask me what to get, if they're not going to get this Rain Song, Black Ice, uh, to heck with all the rest of them, go Washburn. Okay? Um, of course, everybody that's always done the blind tests here on the channel have always picked the $79 Silver Tone guitar with Paul Stanley on the front with dead strings as being the best sounding guitar out of all the Taylors and Martins and blah blah blah. Okay, so what we have today is amazing. Okay, I got this. Um, I want to get it right because I get my washburns here every time and a lot of other things at worldmusicsupply.com. Okay? And they have a ton of washburn stuff on there and they always have these closeout sales. You got to watch for those. I mean, they just blow stuff out, which is what they did here. But now they're back to normal prices. Now, I bought this one as a B stock, and they don't mark them as B stocks at all. Okay. So I asked the guy that uh, was there, I said, can you, because it showed that it has some really cool figuring of things that I'll tell you about in a second and show you. And you know how you get like zebra wood and some of it's just straight and some of it's, just, you know, look like um, the downtown map of L.A. But I said, I wanted one. I said, please find me just the one with the squirreliest wood patterns humanly possible on the sides and back. And uh, he sent me, went in the back, uh, took pictures and said, how is this one? I was like, good lordy, that's the one for me. Okay, and this guitar um, is currently on sale over there at $359.99, and that's the B-Stock. I got mine for $249.99 and some uh, free shipping. What? And they still sell them for that? Yep, dang right. Their retail price is $800. Um, the normal price that you guys buy them for is $479.99 anywhere else. Here, um, and that's for the price of a B stock, and they've got them on sale for $359.99. I got them for $249.99. And the model of this guitar, and I've been waiting for this ever since the Concord, certain Concords back in the 70s, acoustic, not acoustic electric, just acoustic guitars the Ibanez made back when, and they were the only ones to, not the only ones to do so, but I was going to buy one of them or one of these, and I found one of these because better than Ibanez um, on these guitars. And Ibanez was great in the 70s, weren't they? And part of the 80s, all the way up through 1984, and then they've sucked since then. But this guitar is actually called the... BR549. No, it's the WCSD. Why? I don't know. WCSD 30S, like Scott, C E K. WCSD 30S C E K. And that's what it's called. Okay. I'm going to run down the real quick specs. Um, it's got this, it's got that. Um, what do we got? We got a. A solid Sitka spruce top zebra wood. Well, that makes sense, zebra. <laughs> zebra back and sides as well as the bridge. Um, headstock. Um, yes, zebra wood cap. And the pit guard, which I'll show you. Custom wound, inlaid rosette, and maple. Maple. Maple fingerboard on these things. Okay, so beautiful. Don't have to worry about anything at all with these guitars. So you don't have to try to clean your other horrible woods that none of you know how to do properly. Um, we got the uh, Fishman 301T preamp system. I'll play that for you too. Again, I'm just using the mic on whatever this old camera is that cannot zoom out any further in this. I will buy a new one this week or next week though. Uh, the the um, Fishman sounds great. Um, the, 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 the Fishman Sonicore pickup and low pri profile controls, blah, 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 battery indicator light, and it does shut off the signal if you're tuning, okay? And through the rest of it, let's see, anything we need, uh, bracing, quarter saw, and scalloped, 
uh, bracing, custom wood inlay, uh, satin mahogany with two-way truss rod, uh, bone nut inlays, our dots, uh, nut width is 43 millimeters, scale 25 and a half, just same as the strap, electronics I just told you about, anything else, um, tuners or chrome die cast, uh, whatever. They put some Daddario's on there, EXP 16's, and that is it. One or the other thing, it came with the free heavy duty gig bag. You're like, no way. Yeah. <laughs> These guys are awesome. <laughs> World Music Supply. Look at this flipping bag. I mean, that's heavy duty and awesome to look at. <laughs> and it is very thick. It's like, it's like denim material. And it's really nice um, got lots of room for whatever you do now this guitar actually came with a uh, I know it takes forever to get to the guitar because I am Scott Grove <laughs> the guitar actually came with a thin veneer of a zebra wood um, pit guard on it I took it off they even actually sent me a spare one which you just peel the back off of. Okay, so here's the one I took off of it. And then just had to clean up under there a little bit with some things that dissolve, dissolve sticky stuff and that was creamy peanut butter. Okay, then they sent me another one because they let me know that these often come loose, especially from humidity. <laughs> um, there, pull the sticker off and you can put this one back on if you live in a different humidity than where they are. Which, of course, I do, and it did come off. So, um, the axe. Here it is after all that. And if you don't like it, hey, you suck. <laughs> Plain easy. So, there's your veneer here on the top. Wash burn. There you go, kids. Look at that fingerboard. Wham. No, not George Michael Wham. More zebra wood on the... There. Okay. Uh, your preamp all very nice nice and easy as high as mids you got a in and out of phase you got the battery indicator you have the volume you have the uh, tuner and that's it but look at the design that I got I wanted it all over the flipping place and just crazy dark when it came to all this stuff, I wanted it to be seen. I would love to have it on the front because it makes no difference there either. Um, so that's it, and we get to plug it in. So you got the wood inlay, the rosette. Okay, extremely beautiful. Uh, your fret marker quits with one early. <laughs> Um, but you don't use those, you use the ones on the sides. Do they got the one on the sides? Nope, it's missing that same one too. Uh, blah, blah, blah. Okay, you got this all back here. You got these right there. You got a nice satin back here, like everybody's finally learned to do, instead of them nasty other necks from them big companies. Um, no place to hook your strap on. Okay, he said strap on because guitars don't come with those unless they're from somewhere but you can just add it on and if you do you put it in right here with your drill first to do a pilot hole then you put it in but that's where they belong on the underside and out of the way just look at pictures of real guitars and that's where you put it in so I'll just be holding it and playing it and it's just a beautiful axe and again for 249 delivered with all that other stuff here and again I'm not going to use a sticky one um, they come around the mountain. They'll be coming around the mountain when they come with that on there. I just, that was my part that I just couldn't wait to take off. Because I don't use pit guards. I don't if I see any need for them. And therefore, you get that. So, they have the same guitar with the rosewood fingerboard and so forth. But... If you're like me, which nobody is, and you just don't want to ever have to worry about main, maintaining that fingerboard because that will last for you forever and ever and ever, then there you go.
249 B stock again it says it nowhere what is the fault in it nothing it has been factory refurbished so it's as good as new again where does it say second or B stock nowhere what is the fault nothing that we can find <laughs> so it's beautiful okay speaking of beautiful let's just get down here with uh, the taking a seat on my or taking a stool leaving a stool on my seat my Jackson throne okay so let me find are there any guitar picks in this groovy room <laughs> way too many oh there we go good old cactus picks cactus pricks I got pricks on them use them okay so the guitar itself um, Turn the volume up on this sucker. And I've got verb on here. That's reverb. Damn. That much? Hell yeah. bottom in there. I mean it's got some I mean it just goes anywhere you want it but sounds like I I am so 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 digging this thing and it's probably one of the only other guitars I'll keep through my sale uh, I've got rid of a lot of acoustics already but the um, certain washburns are sticking around and this is definitely one of them so go on there world music supply man check out those closeouts and uh, sales they have all the flip of time you can't believe what they let go of for what price? Um, better closeouts than anywhere I've ever, ever, ever seen. And again, personal assistance to go find the wood grain pattern that I was after. So, and he said he went through everything that was on sale and um, shot me some pictures. And I said, hey, that's mine. Send it over to me. And he did. And, you know, customer service out the wazoo. Great axe. So happy to have this one. Um, compared to so many of my other ones and the ones that I've sold and for that kind of price uh, for any price I would have done it because it's just that cool and with the maple fingerboard I mean that's just enough looking different and there's no care involved with it <laughs> hardly at all so that's a beautiful thing people will notice the difference but they won't know what it is you know they just to say that well that's different <laughs> and they're usually saying that about me instead of the guitar but hey that's okay well once again yeah me with my camera guy dr groovy here from groovymusiclessons.com uh the regular channel here and the new channel is called scott grove where i give acoustic lessons 
guitar lessons with no profanity um, on here. So just look up Scott Grove and acoustic lessons and I usually put like five out per time that I do them. Um, starting from the beginning and going through for all you that like um, structured lessons as well. Okay, so you guys be groovy. I'll be back with more stuff. Yeah, I keep getting more stuff. Don't think that I'm going anywhere. <laughs> Later.